Hey friends, so in this video um, we're going to talk about the graphic styles that I have for the thread for Adobe Illustrator. Now I also include um, some nice layer styles in Photoshop if you want to take your designs into Photoshop and finish them off. But also I've got a couple nice styles so that whenever you're creating an Illustrator you know, you like to have that extra bit of realism while you create, or perhaps you don't even want to go into Photoshop um, when you finish your design. So these styles are a great way to add that extra bit of realism in uh, directly in Illustrator while you're creating. So I'm going to show you how to load these styles and apply them. So um, you want to make sure that you have your graphic styles panel open. And if you don't see it, go to Window, graphic styles and it'll fly out and you'll have a few gra default graphic styles um, in your document. So we want to go to the top right corner and click open graphic style library and then go to other library and then navigate to your desktop or wherever your download is and I'm going to go into here and you will see a file called thread styles and click open and then it'll fly out the thread styles window and just like the brushes if you go to the top right corner you can click persistent so that these styles are available available to you no matter what document you're working on so it'll be on all your documents and you don't have to load them each time and so I can just select one of my designs here that I created using just the brushes and to apply this I want to click option while I click this because if I only click this it's going to delete this um, uh, layer style so I'm going to undo that I'm going to click the option or if you're on a PC click alt option and click and that's just going to add this really nice subtle drop sh shadow that adds a little bit of realism and it's lovely for when you're working so it just add, makes it a little bit more fun to see what your creation is going to look like you know so as you're working within Illustrator so I'll just just to give you a little demo here I'll select this little plant that I made and click option like this and you can see the difference already it just adds that little bit of drop shadow that makes it look super great and the good thing is is that you don't even have to leave Illustrator you know you can um, I do have some Photoshop styles uh, that add a little bit of extra boomf, but really, like, Illustrator is all you need. And I'll just do the same thing here to this one and add that style. And you can really see the difference. So it's just, um, I love it. And then I've got two different styles. This is the large shadow and the small shadow. So normally I use the large shadow if you have the brush size like 0.75 points or one point and then the small shadow for the smaller brushes if you're applying the brush in like 0.5 or 0.25 and you can have them as thumbnails here or you can you know view them as a list view but those are the styles within Illustrator and I hope you guys enjoyed that it's just a, a little bit of extra realism and honestly yeah you can do this whole design export it straight from Illustrator and let me know below if you have any questions.